you back in the Super Eagles, this time not as a player, but as a <coughs> member of the technical staff. What's the feeling like? Yeah, it feels good. Um, you know, I'm happy to be here. I think it comes from a place of um, passion and, and love, and I'm grateful for being given the opportunity to serve again in a different capacity. So, yeah, I'm happy. I'm happy. Okay. Yeah. Um, what has been the relationship like with the coach and the other members of the technical staff? Yeah, it's been good. I think um, I developed a relationship on the phone with the coach even before we met. So it was almost like we knew each other on the yeah. phone. So we're just waiting for the physical um, <coughs> appearance, getting to know each other. But um, it's been very good. It's been very good. He's been very... Um, <coughs> He's the head coach, he's the head tactician, and you know he opened his hand and, and welcomed me very well. And with the other staffs, it's been good. It can only, it can only get better. I think when you come in, you're also getting to know people when you meet them. So we are in that phase of getting to know ourselves. But so far in this camp, it's, it's been good. You scream a lot from the bench. The whole stadium <laughs> literally heard your voice. How do you think the players you know, react to your, your instructions from, from the bench? Yeah. I think I noticed something when I came in and, um, you know, because cause I've been through everything they're doing yeah. right now yeah. and, and I, I wish I was in that position as well. So what I thought could have happened to me is what I'm giving to them, exactly. you understand? Yeah. So I realized that when I'm a bit closer to them, they can hear me because football is about communication yeah. and, 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 and organization and being a central defender and a former captain, I think I have that. Yeah, but you know, you just have to help your team. The coach is, is also telling me what to say to them sometimes, so it's, it's a teamwork. You understand it's a teamwork and um, the coach is reading the game and I'm also doing my own part, so we just have to work together to make sure we get a result. And part of that is giving them instruction to know what they're doing, to be aware, because you might be a good player, but sometimes football is about concentration, so you don't get caught up. Absolutely. So that's where in the rebuilding process, so those are the things we're working on. Final question. Thank you. Final question. What do you think about this group compared to the group you played with? Oh, man. This group is talented, but my group was, you know, super talented as well. You just, you wait to see how they develop. I'm just, I'm happy about what we have. You know, in this camp, we missed some of the players, some of our key players were in here, but those that came in did a great job. So we'll wait till we get a full house and, and see how we progress. But Nigeria is always talented. Absolutely. Now is how we can harness them together to play the type of football that the coach wants us to play and, and, and make sure that we get results. Things don't happen overnight. Exactly. You know, you it, can see we're infusing some, some new players as well has been discovered, which is great. That shows the amount of talent that we are blessed with. So hopefully we'll keep building and have a proper team before we go to any tournament. Thank you. All the best. Yeah, it's a pleasure. Thank you.